Hi, I'm Lainey from Lox and Lox of Hairstyles, and today I'm going to do a triple French braid hairstyle going into volcano blend, so keep watching. So I put her hair in three sections, as you can see, and I just twisted them around and put them in with a bobby pin to anchor it. And then in the back I left it hanging in a ponytail. Well, the stuff I need in the back I put in a ponytail. Then brush out your middle section, because that's where we will start, and take a small section from up front and start braiding it. Three strands crossing over. Her hair is pretty fine, so you may have a lot thicker sections to work with here but toss over that strand that you should have crossed over, just throw it over the face or down to the side and grab the section behind it like this. So throw that one over and grab a section underneath and cross that one into the braid instead. So as I cross this one over, instead of bringing it in the braid, I will throw it forward and grab the braid behind it. It's like doing a waterfall braid on both sides. So we're going to dump strands on both left and right. So then I grab some from the right side, cross it into the braid, you get the idea, braid down until you've run out of hair in the section that you divide it off and take a, a little t small rubber band and put it in and then you've got these really pretty strands here and now you have to be careful with them because this braid is not anchored well since we let both sides hang out. And I threw them over the top of her head to get them out of the way while I French braid this side now this side I will French braid normally, but I will take the sections that I left out from the top and add them into my top strand. So I bring that bottom section over and as I go to cross my top one, I will hold it in my hand while I reach up and get the leftover strand from my center braid and bring it over as and add it to my top strand. And notice on the bottom, I collect hair with that lower strand, just like a normal braid. On my top one, my strand is the leftovers. From the upper braid. See, not hard. You're getting the idea. You just add the hair to the bottom and grab the strand from the top. Make sure you puff out your braid before you put in your elastic to make it look thick and even. And then I did a French braid on the other side and now I put it in a ponytail right up where those three small elastics were and you just do it in a loop where I pulled the loop over on the top but I didn't pull the ponytail all the way out. See how I've got my loop? Then I reach my fingers under my elastic, pinch the ends, and pull them through so that you're getting this effect. Now I'll have her turn around so I can see it from the face and how it's going to look. And you just want this to turn out like two really cute stacked buns, one on top of the other. So I will spread out the lower section and bobby pin it so that it gives it a cute circular and puffy shape. Then you want to hide the ends in the center and tuck them down. Roll the back bun up along the front so that they're smashed together. Now I do have my nice puff, but I also want to grab each side and pull it down so that I get a more circular feel and round out that bun. Bobby pin it and you have a really fun updo.